Writing Britain features over 150 incredible treasures from the British Library's collections and loans from other libraries, museums and from individual writers. We're looking at the ways that writers have recorded the changing spaces and places of the British Isles, all the way back to Chaucer's pilgrims who gathered in a tavern in Southwark, through the Yorkshire moors described by Emily Bronte, right up to the suburban hinterlands of writers such as J.G. Ballard. To give you a sense of just some of the literary treasures that we're featuring in the exhibition, we've got a notebook carried by William Blake in the 1790s when he walked around London. We've got an early draft of Robert Louis Stevenson's Strange Case of Dr. Jekyll and Mr. Hyde. We've got some drafts of Charles Dickens's great London novel Our Mutual Friend that he rescued from the Staplehurst train crash. We've got more contemporary material. There's notes of J.G. Ballard. We've got the incredible manuscript by J.K. Rowling of the first Harry Potter book. And we've got an unknown lyric by John Lennon for a Beatles song in my life. Writing Britain is a celebration of more than a thousand years of English literature and of more than a thousand years of incredible treasures from the British Library's collections.